What is up my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John City 4 and hopefully you guys enjoy the gameplay in the background. It is some Black Ops 2 old school gameplay guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. And also, the Modern Warfare trilogy has finally been released. On the last generation. Are you stupid or something? Like, are you serious, Activision? You're gonna release this trilogy on the last gen on the PS3 and the Xbox 360. You do know that your servers are hacked up the fucking ass, right? All servers, Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare 2, and Modern Warfare 3. You know, Call of Duty 4 has this special thing, like where letters fall off the fucking screen, and they're all like rainbowish and shit, like it's crazy, man, the fucking letters. And then it's also like post like the, the YouTuber's name, like, oh, I hacked this thing, and you know, subscribe to me, blah, blah, subscribe for me for more hacks. Like, those people are fucking stupid. And then Modern Warfare 2 has the 50-foot jump thing, you know, I, th I think all Call of Duty's have it, but you know, they have the 50 foot jump thing, everybody's invisible, everybody's going through the walls, automatic aim, you know. You have all this shit on these servers, on the last gen, both PS3 and Xbox 360, and you can, you dare release a fucking trilogy for 30 bucks? Oh, but wait, but wait guys, wait guys, hold on. Hold to your fucking nuts right now. They are releasing a DLC map pack on Modern Warfare 2. And guess how many? Just one DLC map pack. Am I supposed to be like squirting right now or something? Am I supposed to be wet over that shit? Really? Activision? It's stupid, man. To be honest, this whole situation is stupid because they're releasing something that should not have been released on the last gen. The last gen is done, man. We're on the current gen. We're in the current now. We're in the now. It pretty much tells you where the mine of Infinity Ward and Sledgehammer games are. To be honest, like they are stuck in the past. I know we are stuck in the past. You know, all Call of Duty players are because we want a Call of Duty 4 or a Modern Warfare 2 remake, you know, on the current gen. We want to play those games instead of what we're getting right now. But, you know, you can do it in a better way instead of releasing it on the last gen, you know, the trilogy. You should have been releasing it on the next gen on the PS4 and the Xbox One. Because imagine this you're playing Modern Warfare 2, like it was your first fucking day, the fresh day out of release. And nobody's hacking you. Nobody's going through the walls. Nobody's auto-aiming uh, auto you. No, nobody's doing shit to you. Because you're playing the game normally. How it's meant to be played. So you pretty much experience every single level. Nobody hacks you. Nobody's forcing you to go from 0 to freaking 50. Like right off the freaking second. Because there's no hackers. There's no hackers on PS4 and Xbox One. So imagine all that. You cannot be feeling the experience of what it used to be. So why didn't you fucking release it on the next gen PS4 and Xbox One? Activision is stupid. Clay's case closed. Case fucking closed. I don't understand this whole situation, man, to be honest. And I do not support any of the moves by Activision. And if some big YouTuber out there did buy the trilogy, just to show you guys what they have in the game, just for you guys to be aware, they are fucking traitors. You see, by them giving Activision money from the trilogy, for the trilogy, that's supporting the idea of the trilogy being released on the last gen, which means there are 100% on the Activision side releasing that freaking thing on the freaking last gen. I am pretty sure Activision was smoking crack before, you know, deciding where this game was going to go, either last gen or next gen. They must have had pressed the wrong button because, you know, they would have have earned shitloads of money releasing the, the trilogy on the next gen, to be honest, and the freaking Infinity War game would be deserted. Nobody would be playing that game, only like money hungry YouTubers, which I am not. You know, I would not be showing Infinity War if they would have released the trilogy on the next gen. So that is it for now, guys. That's all I wanted to talk about. Tell me your opinions in the comment section. What do you guys think? Should have uh, Activision released, you know, the, the whole trilogy on the next gen or not? I'm 100% sure everybody's going to be answering yes, they should have released the freaking trilogy on the next gen. But that is it guys, subscribe for more, you guys want to hear more topics.